On a wet 4th of July weekend on Long Island, week four of the PLL season continues with Paul Rabel's Cannons Lacrosse Club taking on chaos. Both teams off to a one and three start. So it's a one minute Vineyard Vines power play for Cannons. Lyle Thompson to Paul Rabel from two and a stop is made by Blaze Reardon. He was trying to get it out of the way early. Paul Rabel needs two points to tie John Grant Jr. And if that went, he would have done it with one shot. Rabel. Lyle Thompson down tight off the bar behind Reardon. What a good look for Fercaro, and he got something along the way. They'll get a reset of the shot clock. That one snuffed out and stolen away by Reese Eddie. He's off to the races. Eddie, the feed, the save from Reardon. Shane Jackson denied in yeah, tight. Transition. Rafus. Nice pass. Another stop by Reardon. Then Rafus got the rebound, but it popped straight out of his stick. Another gem on the left side of your screen here. Strong dodge by Rafus. He quickly finds Jackson, who's finally in the lineup. In Cannon's favor, they lead it 2 0. Here's seven minutes in. Dean Smith. As Rabel defensively, who lost his stick, the pass, and the shot goes off the bar. Kyle Jackson with the look. Hit the pipe, stayed out, and now it's Cannon's ball. And Morocco wisely identifies that that's still technically a shot. So on that run out, he wins the race to where the ball went out. Let's take a look at the left side of your screen and square off the bar from Kyle Jackson. 10 goals this season as well. Four different Cannons players as Reardon comes up with the stop on Drenner. Came into the weekend tied for second in the PLL with 10 goals. Four of them. Busick plays it down and Reardon with the save again on Shane Jackson. Well, he's had his chances. Now gives to Drenner. Busick on the run. Busick hangs on to it with some good defense, made the pass, and another stop by Reardon on Shane Jackson. And now it's Burns setting up Troy Ray. Save Morocco. McKay on the rebound. You'll see in transition, Ray wisely trails behind the play and lines this up. It just hits Morocco square in the chest. And during that recovery, McKay, Johnny on the spot. The most notable thing is that it's the goal. That's right. So five minutes without Nick Morocco means we will see Jacob Stover come in. It is his debut. He's been the backup for Nick Morocco here for the first four games. So while, yes, it is even, it's not even. As Morocco got involved. And he's never really seen legitimate professional time before. On the MLL register, put up 39 points that year, four last year. To get to 643 is Mac O'Keefe <laughs> with a barrel of moves. And Stover comes up huge. Hello, Jacob Stover. And as they return the pass on for Tim Edwards, you take a look at the save and a flag comes in here. Rabel working on CJ Costabile. Rabel gets loose. Rabel's shot denied by Reardon. Open field here and knifing through Stover. Makes another quality save that time on Kyle Jackson. How about Stover? <laughs> Just an audition here. I mean, Morocco is clearly the starter, but there's a lot of teams around the league. Maybe not a lot, but a few. Maybe one we just saw. <laughs> Camp behind. All those penalties have expired, so Morocco is eligible to come back in next chance they get is Lyle Thompson. Didn't get a lot in that shot as Rowlett was physical on Lyle Thompson. And Thompson really handles physical play quite well. 
usually uses that against the defender. It looked like Rowlett just kind of got one. Three goals, two of them have been two pointers. And here he is from inside the arc. And yep, another stop for Jacob Stover. Stover was taken in the expansion draft off the Whip Snakes roster. Are available exclusively on Peacock. Nick Morocco back in net. Four cannons. He's had two four point games out of his first four. And Steven Rafis for Dreader. Stopped by Reardon. He went down and got it on what looked like a sure thing for Ryan Drenner. Transition to offense. We take a look at the progressive game flow as the timeout is called. <laughs> Stack pad save. That time by Blaze Rudin. Back to Rabel. One more time to Q. The look was there. Jackson across. Thompson stopped by Reardon. That is his 11th save so far. Steven Rafis is off to another fantastic start. Opens things up for Drenner. Save number 12 for Blaze Reardon. Played his college lacrosse here as a member of Hofstra Pride. And now it's Adler bouncing one off the faceoff win. Save Morocco. Rebound for Reese Eddy. Had a couple of chances. Didn't get it. Ball pushed out of bounds. It'll go to Cannons. Four Cannons has been involved, let's just say that. Here he is again, and that time he was sworn by the Chaos defense and Reardon with a relatively routine save. Yeah, good call. Power play today for Chaos. A chance to even the score. Save Morocco and a big rebound that bounces all the way out of bounds. And off the hustle, it is Cannon's ball. Out of the field for Carl. Dane Smith rolls on Merrill and the stop made by Morocco. Ball was there and Byrne was able to find it. Defender of the game presented by CrowdStrike, Blaze Reardon. 13 saves would be a very different game if he wasn't at the top of his. Yeah, we well, shouldn't be too soon too surprised. The two-time reigning goalie of the year. But he's been absolutely fantastic, particularly in tight. He just drops down, but is able to keep his stick high on a lot of these. Use it, able to use that big frame. Thompson drew Newman, then fed it. Drenner skips it. Busick unloads a bouncer. Dug out by Reardon. Would have been a two. I think Rush might have got a little piece of that. Newman let it go, but it winds up right to Morocco. As Newman snapped the head off his stick on the follow through, and Blaze Reardon comes out to make a play and keep it away from Drenner and Cannons. Pushed there. Rabel in transition. The seas parted for him that time, and he threw everything he had into the shot, and it was still stopped by Blaze Reardon. Chaos quickly ahead. Cloutier with the goal. And it starts with Reardon. Clean saves. Equal transition. He gets the ball up and out, and Costabile quickly identifies. You're being, you're going with C, huh? That's right. <laughs> Burn shovels it over for Smith, and he missed it. Ryan Smith with a wide open look. Defense has stalled here in the second half. Everybody but Rabel has reared and got a piece of that try. Inside two minutes. Drenner sets up shot behind. Now gets topside. Leans back. Drenner. Save made by Reardon. Number 18 today. A good anticipation there by Reardon on that question mark by Drenner. Anticipating that low and away shot. Playing from behind in that category as well. Byrne. He'll take it with Morocco scrambling back into the net. And they reset the shot clock as Morocco got a piece of that. As Chaos takes over in the second half, and they win 14-10.